You gotta fight uh, uh, for the right to party. Good morning, everybody. It is Tuesday, May 12, 2015. I am Jeffrey G, and this is my co-host, the Dutch Man. Hi, Dutch. How you doing today? Good. Dutch and I hope that you guys all had a great yesterday, and we hope that we're taking care of you. Um, but happy Tuesday, everybody. So I had to wake up super early this morning, A, to film the show. Right after filming, I have to, and you know, I have to take a shower and do all that stuff. But right after filming, I have to go to the doctor's because I got my blood work back and I have really high triglycerides and cholesterol. So we got to discuss what we're going to do about that. And I'm just going to say, can you Give me the lap band, a little lap band surgery. He's going to change my whole entire diet. Uh, not at all. Maybe I should exercise, who knows. But we're discussing options of what I can do for my cholesterol. And then I got to go right from there and go right to work. Now, yesterday, Monday, the restaurant was so dead. And I left early. And everyone's like, well, why do you always leave early? And I'm like, because... I don't want to stand there with no tables. I'd rather leave early. Well, if you say you can make an extra 20 or 30 bucks, uh, I'd rather leave. So, yes, I left early yesterday, and I'll probably leave early today if I can. If not, then I tried. But, um, you know, I'm still bothered by that person that says that they don't think I'm going to make it in television. And to pursue something else. Like, today's day two and it's still in the back of my head. Um, so I'm going to make some decisions. And, you know, all my quotes say, you know, be fearless. Don't let fear get in the way. And I've let fear get in the way. I'm totally nervous. And, you know, because this is my last hurrah. If I go to L.A., that's it. If I go to New York, that's it. So... If I don't do it and I don't make it, then I'm going to have to do something else. So, if you're interested in supporting the Jeffrey G. Show, you can go to my website, jeffreygshow.com, and click on Donate and donate a couple bucks. Um, but my next step will be strategic, not like Jeffrey is normally impulsive. Um, but tonight will be good TV. I'm... We'll stay awake for Dance Moms with Abby Lee Miller. I can't wait to see what she does tonight. They're back in L.A. Maybe I'll date Abby Lee Miller if I go to L.A. Just kidding. So, I forgot to tell you guys, over the weekend, guess who was in the restaurant? Joey Gladstone from Full House. Dave Coulier cut it out. Anyways, he was a... Uh, a little bit of a jerk because one of the servers went over and was like, Hey, Uncle Joey, cut it out. And he's like, Oh, please don't have people come up doing that. But um, I'm like, You're lucky you're still relevant. You're only relevant because Alanis Morissette wrote, You ought to know about you. And it was like the best album of the decade. So that's what I would have said. Dave Coulier. I don't even know if he does stand up anymore. And I'm going to do stand-up, and I'm going to be funny, damn it. And people are going to laugh. But, um, Fox announced they will be doing one more season of American Idol. American Idol 15 next fall, and then that's it. Fox is pulling American Idol off the air. And I, I perfectly agree, because it is time to move on. I would have pulled that show ten years ago, or when Simon Cowell left. But... Whatever. And actor Morgan Freeman, you know, says he will eat, drink, smoke, snort, pot. He's a big advocate on marijuana usage. He uses it. He's very open about it. And he's doing press for his new movie. And he's very open about it. And he wants it legalized um, in all 50 states. Go ahead, Morgan. I'll smoke a little ganja with you. 
but I got some celeb news, some more celeb news. Gwyneth Paltrow and Chris Martin um, spent Mother's Day together with their children together, which I think is appropriate, even though they're not together, but she's the mother of their children, and you gotta get along with your ex-spouse, or whoever, whoever the heck you want to call it. And, uh, Chloe and uh, Chloe Kardashian and Kendall Jenner, sisters, were at the LA Clippers game and they showed their faces on the big screen and they got booed! That must be so embarrassing. Like, you have the number one show and you're getting booed. Because people love to hate them. Like, people love to hate me. Oh well, love to hate me, bitches! And Lindsay Lohan is set to finish up her community service at a Brooklyn preschool. And Prince performed in Baltimore over the weekend and um, gave his voice of encouragement um, for peace. Zendaya, uh, you know, she's on the Disney Channel. Um, she celebrated her high school graduation this past weekend. Congratulations, Zendaya. And Beyonce um, thinks that there is a negative stereotype on being a vegan or vegan food and the vegan lifestyle. Well, Beyonce, maybe that's because you can't eat anything and that's why people lose so much weight. And Mariah Carey was gifted a $400,000 pair of diamond earrings at her Las Vegas residency. She invited the guy that owned the diamond shop and he brought those for her as a gift to keep. Go ahead, Mariah. And New Kids on the Block, Jonathan Knight got punched in the face somehow and broke his nose and had stitches on the tour bus so he couldn't perform with New Kids on the Block. Oh, oh, oh! Oh, oh, oh! The right stuff. All right, got some quotes for you today. It is Tuesday. Be there for others, but never leave yourself behind. I've got to follow that one. Because I will be there so much for others. I leave myself behind, then i got to ask for donations. Last hurrah, i got to make a decision. Anyways, common sense is a flower that doesn't grow in everyone's garden. Sure doesn't grow in mine. And there is a champion inside each and every one of us. That says, desire, dream, and vision. That is true. And don't tell people your dreams. Show them! And that's what I'm doing with the Jeffrey G Show. Uh, shout out to Carolyn McCarthy. Uh, LGBT groups on Facebook and LinkedIn. And Mama G, P. Hayes, Shane P. Everybody out there that likes Jeffrey G, I gotta go cause I'm gonna freestyle and I know it's gonna make you smile, but the show will be out again tomorrow, so don't go and be so sorrow, have a great, totally excellent, awesome day, love, the Dutchman.